some actual facts. Prime Minister David Cameron has urged British voters not to roll the dice on their children's futures by quitting the European Union. In the first major TV debate over whether the UK should stay or leave the bloc, he said a vote to exit would be an economically self-inflicted wound. He also insisted he'd take Britain into the EU under the special terms it now enjoys if it wasn't already a member. I've enhanced our special status with real protections for Britain in the bits we want to be in, principally the single market, but out of the bits we don't like, like the Eurozone and the no-border zone. So on that basis, yes, if I was offered the terms of another country, well, that'd be a different matter. But Britain's terms are right for Britain, and I think we should stay in. But Cameron's opponents have dismissed his warnings over a possible exit as scaremongering. Earlier prominent Leave campaigner Boris Johnson continued his push for the UK to quit the EU. What proportion of laws going through the Palace of Westminster do you think come from Brussels at the moment? Does anybody have an idea? Who will give me? Who will give me? Who will give me thirty percent? Any advance on thirty? Thirty advance on thirty percent. Should I tell you the answer? It's not quite seventy-five. Say it's sixty percent. Meanwhile, in London, Britain's main opposition leader, Labour's Jeremy Corbyn, called on supporters to back the Remain campaign. Polls ahead of the June 23rd referendum on Britain's continued EU membership remain tight.